Hi team, it's John, and today we're going to be doing some testing on the integrity and properties of the release mechanism in the JRB hitch. I'll be performing this testing here in my home laboratory slash workout area of my basement on, on a Smith machine which has a 30 millimeter bar, standard for Olympic lifting bars. And I'll be using a fixed weight of 100 kilograms. And so I'm going to put on my scale, which tears to zero. And summoning my strength, I will be releasing this load. Pardon me, because I am the lifter, the tester, and the cameraman. And we'll just zoom in there a bit. And you can see the load. This, the light on my scale, the backlight goes off after a couple of seconds. So we'll do our best to make sure you stay informed. All right, let's get on with the testing. Okay, so I've got a brand new piece of 10.1 millimeter Sterling Pro dynamic climbing rope. And the system is currently loaded with 100 kilograms. I will be pulling on this Garda hitch, which has got my scale uh, in series on a three to one mechanical advantage system. Now the scale will be out of reach and I've already done a dozen pulls. And I'm getting essentially a two stage release with approximately 50 to 60 kilograms of load required to spill that hitch. And so what I'll be doing is zooming in on the hitch so you can examine it as I engage the load on the system. And again, I am the cameraman as well as the tester so bear with me my scale is on and it has teared I'm going to start pulling and at around 30 kilograms that loop starts to move and at around 50 or so it breaks through so that's the first stage I would call it and now I need closer to 60 to get this second stage. Now if I were to release the line, it would go. And there we go. I'll be repeating. Okay, this will be pull number two on the Sterling Pro 10.1 millimeter rope. Go slowly as I can practically. At around 30, it starts to move. I don't really feel anything with that first loop getting loose. I don't feel anything there but then it gets, the resistance goes up to release that stage and up again. And this will be pull number three on the Sterling Pro 10.1 millimeter line with a different camera angle for you. Resistance goes up here, reduces, I can that line will almost hold with no resistance on the line, but if I let go completely, it would drop. Okay, and this will be pull number four on the Sterling Pro 10.1, different angle. Okay, and on this my last pull, I'm going to let the first stage go, and then I'm going to let go of the rope. So about 30 to get there, about 50 to 60 to break this. And now if I let go, and this is a Sterling Oplux 8 millimeter static rope. This is pull number two with the Sterling 8mm Oplux. And this is pull number three with the Sterling 8mm Oplux.
and one more pull with the Sterling 8mm Oplux. And now I have rigged a Sterling Super Static 2 in 9.5 millimeters. Another pull on the Sterling Super Static 2. And one more look at the Sterling Super Static 2. Okay, so that's the end of the test. To review, we loaded the system with 100 kilograms and we pulled multiple releases with the Sterling Pro 10.1 millimeter rope, which has an EN892 rating. A number with the rope in the middle, which is a Sterling Oplux 8 millimeter. And on the right, a Sterling Super Static 2 in 9.5 millimeters with an NFPA 1983 technical rating. And uh, up on the system, catching my system was actually a pair of the JRB hitches on either side. So I've released the load, but not the line. And so uh, totally unrehearsed, I'm going to see how difficult it is to release this with, with, one, with one hand. So that's my left hand pulling on that after a number of drops. So let's go to the other side of the system. Same deal. It really does spill very nicely after the load has been removed. And so uh, hopefully this uh, test gives us a little better idea of its release characteristics. Again, the numbers I was seeing on the scale in terms of the two-stage release were in the 50 to 60 kilogram range for each of the two stages. By my feel, the second stage was a little bit more difficult, but as I exhibited with the very first uh, rope, if I were to just let go after the first stage, the system will spill. Thank you very much, and I look forward to your comments and for tests to come. Thank you.